Happy Halloween, everyone. This is Josh with Rec and Rack again. And with all the excitement about the fly box that we're getting close to store release, part of that we want to um, give a little demo or go through some of the features of this box. So in front of me, this is uh, pretty comparable to our standard box. Uh, we got the polycarbonate in the front, black high density seaboard material on the top and sides and bottom, all attached with stainless steel hardware with a stainless steel latch. Got a handle on the top, and then we're still utilizing our friction hinges. And then here's what's underneath the hood. So we got lure racks on the edges and then four of them in the middle here. What's pretty cool about this is that <clears throat> we just fi finalized the design with a manufacturer and make these custom hooks. Hopefully you can see that. And what you do is you can actually place these wherever you would like on these lure hangers and they snap into place which the benefit of that is when you're hanging your lures and you go to take the lure out of the box you won't have to worry about these pulling off as you can see i'm tugging on this pretty good so that's one pretty cool or neat feature also this box is pretty modular in the sense that <clears throat> we drilled a couple holes on the side there capped them off gives you the flexibility if you wanted to attach a tool holder on the side here which would come with the necessary fasteners another thing pretty cool about this box is that these lure hangers are removable and the purpose of that is so <clears throat> the box will come standard with four but if you want to purchase some additional lure hangers this way you know if you got something you can hang them with or the accessory will be coming out with you can hang all your lures if there's certain sizes colors you can have them all loaded and then you can just you know pick it up bring it over here and then pop it in the box just like that another feature is that on the ends here you can see we milled the slot on the front and the back and if you, instead of hanging lures, if you want, you want some additional storage, you just take off the lure hanger and the rib. And then here's a divider. And I'm going to push the lid back a little bit. And that would slide right in place. If you don't want it, you can slide that right out. Pop your rib back in. And then pop your lure hanger. And as far as how many lures you can fit in here, we have holes drilled every half inch. Depending on the size of the bait, you might be able to utilize every half inch or every other hole. But I would assume you could probably fit at least 100 baits in here. And again, that's based on the size of the lure. So, excited getting close to store release but wanted to share a video of what what's underneath the hood and and some options that this box can offer you uh, something totally different as to what's even available out on the market so if you guys have any other questions let me know send us an email give me a call other than that uh, we look forward to uh, getting these in the store of musky fool all right thank you